So I'm hoping that I can do a series of shorter videos. Um, this is the first. I don't know if I'll make five, six, four. I don't know. Um, but this is all about our botanical foundation. Um, these are two main ways you can get it are by itself or in this little palette. Um, I'm going to try to just use my foundation and then see if I need to add more concealer from there. Um, you can also get it in various collections. I have eye products and lip products along with it. Um, but yeah, we're going to get started. So um, you can either use a blenderful. This is our blenderful. Um, it's a beauty blender, um, latex free. And basically it's like super duper squishy, super soft. Um, it has a pointed edge, it has a flat edge, it has a rounded side, and like, I don't know, a less rounded side. And then it has this mesh case that you get it with. Hello, mother. <laughs> and then um, the other way that you can do it is with a brush. And so you can do it with, kind of depending on whatever preference you like. This is more of a a stippling, like blending brush. Um, otherwise, if you want to try to use like a softer brush, you can do that too. Um, the main thing you need to know is the foundation is wax based. So it needs to be warmed up a little bit in order to spread more easily. And so that's why when you twist this in there or rub your brush in there, you get a little friction. So I'm going to do half on one side of my face and half on the other side of my face. Who are you with, mom? <laughs> so I did kind of like a couple half twists and because I'm running lower, obviously I love this foundation. Um, I didn't get any in the middle, but we should be good. So I'm just press, press, pressing into the skin. You're with Jill. Are you with Jill? <laughs> That's my only guess. So I hope it is. I was like, I'm gonna go live on my beauty page because nobody will be on there and then I can focus. Wah, wah. <laughs> Yay, I win! Hi, Jill. That's hilarious. I'm like, oh my goodness, it better be Jill because no one else is coming to my mind and I would feel so guilty. Yay, I win. So press, press, press. Press, press, press. Oh yeah, because she wants to get the same collection that you have. Yes! <laughs> okay, so see how that nice... It's just a nice finish. Um, it kind of looks like skin, right? So we have that. And then I'm gonna do the rest of it with a brush. I'll show you two different brushes. Um, and this is my color Shinto One. I'm gonna just kind of brush it. Oops, I told you I was gonna do different brushes. I'm gonna brush this on this side of my face and then I'll do the other one on top. I'm hoping that these can be like little shareable videos. So when people have questions, I can just share these with them. Kind of like you two both said, to make shorter videos. Look at this, we're all in one place. <laughs> so that's the finish with this brush. And this is our, what is this brush? I don't know, brush number five. And we do have a larger version of this, which might be easier, but then you're not going to get into these little crevices as much. So it's kind of like do you want more precision or do you want more time? If that makes sense. Look at that. Ooh, that was actually pretty good. So it's a buffer brush. That's what it is. <laughs> That's the name. Nailed it. Um, and then I'm going to try it with this brush too. This is usually what I use for powder. But I'm going to put it in here. Like I said, when you get like the little friction going. Um, you hoo Hello. <laughs> That reminds me of, um, oh, what is it? and Frozen, where the guy is like in the hot tub. He's like, yoo-hoo. That's such a silly part of the movie, but that's what it reminds me of. Okay, so look at that beautiful, blah, 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 beautiful flawless finish, right? So it just looks like skin, feels like skin. It's pretty freaking bomb. Um, like I said, 50% pigmented. I think, did I say that? So basically a little bit goes a long way and it lasts you a really long time because you don't hardly need anything. Like you saw, there was like nothing on this brush. So that is the end of this video. I'm gonna keep making more videos. So I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. If you have questions about this foundation, please leave a comment below. Um, I do suggest um, priming with our first base makeup primer. I did that before the video. And then after I do all the rest of my face, I will set it with our makeup finishing spray. So leave any questions below. Send me a picture of your pretty face in natural sunlight with your neck and your face showing um, no makeup on and I can send you a color match. So thanks for watching and be blessed.